I told you you had an ice maker other than your freezer that will make 26 pounds of ice per day. Now, we're just heading into the fall season of the year. Holidays are upon us. Maybe you're hosting this year. When you have a party and someone calls you and they're on the way over and they say, any last minute things you need me to bring? What do I always scream into the phone? Ice! Because I forgot about ice, right? And I go to my freezer and my ice maker works. It's as slow as Christmas. I mean, it just churns out really slowly. Imagine 26 pounds a day. And this uses regular tap water. Certainly you can use bottled water if you like. You don't have to because it doesn't require any special eye, special water and you're going to get up to 26 pounds per day. Now I have this in the white or what we call fresh linen. This is our black stainless. This is red stainless and this is regular stainless. Control panel across the top. Plug this in. If you're using it outside, don't put it in direct sunlight because it's only going to slow it down. Probably better to put this inside and you're going to see you're going to get much better output. If you know you're going to have a big get together, start making ice a few days in advance. Take it out and freeze it in bags. And then you've got all that extra ice when the time comes. Let's invite in Kara DeFalco. She's a member of our Cooks Essentials team, a brand you'll only find here on QVC. And you know her best from YouTube, Kara's Cucina. She knows a little bit about the kitchen and a whole lot about something called <laughs> beautiful ice, 26 pounds a day. Kara, welcome back. Hey, hey, David. Yes, absolutely. You know, David, what my dad just said to me as I was getting this all set up, we are all going into fall. We're going into tailgating season. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I, I, technically it's MetLife Stadium, but in my mind, it'll always be Giant Stadium. I mean, these guys bring in these whole setups. This would be perfect for that. The beer stays cold, the soda stays cold, the water is chilled, and you can plug it right into the truck or the car or the van, whatever you've got going on for the tailgate. So this is going to be perfect coming up for that ongoing football season. And like you said, 26 pounds of ice in a day. So I'm going to show you really briefly what you get. So you've got our little tray here where our ice goes. I'm going to dump this right into my cooler where I have all of our ice. And then all you do, like you said, David, you can just fill this with tap water, filtered water, bottled water, whatever you want to be using. There's a max fill line. It just goes right into the front basin here. You put your water in. You're going to put your tray back in the front. And then on that control panel, you have a selection between two different sizes of ice cubes. So the cubes on this come in both a small and a large size. And they have this really unique shape. They're kind of bullet shaped. They're hollow on the inside. And this serves a couple of different purposes. One, have you if you've ever played this game with the water bottle and the square cubes? Uh-huh. Right? Yeah, that's a lot of fun. So the the bullet shaped ones go right into those skinny necked bottles that we all carry around with us to have water with us, which is good. We should do that. But then also because they're hollow on the inside, when you toss them into your drink, you get a little more surface area. So you're getting your drink colder faster. Yeah, I don't mind tomato juice as long as it's all surrounded by ice cubes. <laughs> And a little, yeah. <laughs> a little vodka and a stalk of celery in there. Yeah, exactly. Nice little celery stick in there. Yeah, that's not Maybe, about right. <laughs> maybe an everything bagel. Bloody Mary. Yeah, oh, that might not be bad. Now either. you're talking. Yeah. Hello. Yeah, that sounds fantastic. Yeah. Oh, my other one just just dropped the ice. So, yeah. So it makes this, it makes the ice. It takes it about seven or eight minutes to make a round of cubes, and then it'll automatically drop them into your bucket on your control panel. It'll let you know if you need to add in more water. It'll let you know if the ice tray is full. And David, like you said, if you are entertaining at all for the balance of the summer going into the fall, the holiday season, absolutely take this, plug it in the night before, let it get going, stash out that ice in bags in the freezer, and you will be ready to roll. And, you know, so many people these days, they have the ice maker in the door of the freezer, but it's just not going to produce enough for a huh. gathering of folks, you know, that's your day to day, of course. But um, and then also folks who are in campers, RVs, trailers who, you know, kind of live that van life. This is another wonderful thing to keep with you, because, again, it plugs right into that standard outlet that all the modern vehicles have now. And so it's an easy thing to take with you on the road. You know, Kara, recently I was in someone's home, a really fancy home, and they had a wet bar mm -hmm. and an ice maker built into their bar. And I thought, oh, that's lovely. Until they told me how much it costs. And then I and they went oh. into the kitchen 
and it made the most racket of anything I'd ever heard in my life. And this is so quiet and so unobtrusive. That built-in ice maker could wake the dead. I mean, good <laughs> grief. I mean, if you're in the middle of a big party, I guess it's fine. But if you're there quietly watching television, and suddenly that thing starts creaking and moaning and dropping ice. and Yeah. Uh, not to mention this the draining. Really and the Oh, all that mess. So this is. This has a really satisfying sound. Yeah, totally. And discreet and beautiful. Here comes the ice. Here it comes. There it oh, comes. There you go. Oh, that's a nice shot. Very nicely done. <laughs> I'd like to take you credit for that, perfectly. but you know what? The machine did all the heavy lifting. And look how you got <laughs> all of those cylinders in there. And you know what? You're yeah. saying to yourself, do I really need an ice machine until the day you need it? And then you will wish you had already gotten it tonight when it's already at a featured price. Now, ordinarily at retail, this is 100 or excuse me, on QVC, $142.98. We are $13 less. So if you're looking to pick this up, I've got color choices for you. I have fresh linen. I have black stainless. Most limited in the black stainless. Here's red stainless. And finally, stainless steel. If you have stainless steel appliances in your kitchen and you're hosting Thanksgiving this year, you need an ice maker to rust. Because you know what Uncle Frank loves his before, during, and after dinner cocktail. Always does. That's why we want to invite him like every third year. And then you've got an opportunity to enjoy extra ice for parties, for get togethers, or just for a big family. Because if you reach into your ice maker in the freezer and find it almost empty, and if you're going to be waiting on it to make more ice, it makes like five cubes every hour or something. It's incredibly slow. Don't let that happen to you when it's this simple and it's this easy. If you're not using it, just drain it and store it away once it's good and dry. But when you need it, you've always got ice at the ready. When plugged in and kept full of water, this will produce 26 pounds of ice in a single day. That's a lot of ice. And Kara, if we start a few days before the party, you're all set, right? You're all set, David. Yeah, and just to kind of give everybody a visual of what 26 pounds of ice might look like, you know, I stacked up my beach cooler. I'm, I'm a summer girl. I don't like to rush these seasons. So, you know, I still got the wine chillers in here ready to rock for the beach. But it was so funny that you mentioned having a large family, Italian kid from Jersey, right? Come from a big family. Can I tell you how much of my childhood was spent getting in trouble because I emptied one of these and didn't fill it back up and put it in the freezer so there was ice for the next person? So, again, problem solved. Exactly. And if you are someone that uh, still is filling ice trays, you need this ice maker. Trust me. This is going to be a such, uh, such a help. And you're making a, a, a summer sangria. You're making a beautiful iced lemonade. You're making spa water. You're doing whatever. Here we've got cucumbers and some kind of red liquid, which I have to assume is pink lemonade. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. Watermelon? It, uh, maybe it's watermelon. Watermelon and cucumber. It looks Could lovely. Be. Watermelon and cucumber, maybe. Um, but it's cold, I can tell you that, because I see all that ice in Absolutely. there. Absolutely. Hey, and I did the same thing, David. I've got my shrimp cocktail here ready to roll out on ice. It's still a bit warm and humid here, but I don't have to worry about the food going bad. I was able to pull that ice right out of the machine, dump it in the bowl, and arrange my shrimp on top. A charcuterie or a cheese board, that would be wonderful to just set out on top of that plate of ice. And again, you've got plenty here because it just makes so much of it in a single day. Now, uh, colors to choose from, we have the fresh linen, black stainless, Here's the red stainless. Looks like candy apple red, if you ask me. And then finally, stainless steel. All this at $129.98. Five easy payments on your credit card. Kara DeFalco, a real pleasure to have you on the show tonight. My pleasure as always, David. Nice to see you, my friend. Now, I'll see you soon. Uh, it is now exactly 9.48 p.m. East Coast time. At 9.59, this item.